Are you ready to hear about the first ever European sex championships? Born ready, my friend. Yes, tell us all about it. So the Swedish Sex Federation actually tried to register sex as a sport. Okay. They got denied. Mm -hmm. So it's been in the news the last couple of weeks, the fact that they got denied, but they're still going ahead with this championship, which kicks off in two days, right? Mm -hmm. So the championship was pitched to take place under the guidance of the Federation to go for six weeks. Wow. Participants are engaging in different sexual activities for 16 different disciplines. Yeah, so it's like a, a tournament. Basically, yeah. right? So there's 20 people involved. Uh-huh. Like a uh, round robin. It's... Oh, so hang on, not, not 10 couples nope. to make up 20 people. Nope. 20 individuals. So they will engage in these different uh, disciplines mm -hmm. for 45 minutes to an hour, right? Okay. In each of their matches. So some reports are actually claiming that some of the right, yep, okay, so. that some of the competitions could actually last up to six hours. And well, some of them might only last a minute or two. Possibly, yeah. yep. So there's going to be a panel of three judges and audience ratings to decide the winner. Mm -hmm. So they will be decide on their knowledge of sex, their chemistry with the person that they're doing it with, okay. communication between them and their partner, yes. um, the appearance of how they look while they're doing it. Mm -hmm. um, also, knowledge of the Kama Sutra will give them some bonus points as well. Oh, okay, as in how to mix it up and get yourself into different uh, yes. situations and positions. Exactly. Yes. After this competition mm. goes through for the first ever year, this championship, as of next year, who knows, maybe sex might be an Olympic sport. I don't know. Well, look, look, we've all come across people in our lives that claim to be pretty good <laughs> at doing it. You know what I mean? At least this way, this could clearly define who is good at it. You know what I mean? Like if you walk into someone's bedroom and they've got a few gold and silver medals hanging up on the wall. they got trophies. Yeah. And you know, there's, there's like certain uh, depictions of positions on the, on the medals. You're like, ah, this guy. Do you want to be with that person? Yeah. Well, yeah you maybe want to get things checked out, double-checked and triple-bagged yeah. before, before you get yourself involved. <laughs> yeah.